una bellissima intervista però adesso dato che ha pochissimo tempo in quanto sta andando a Olgiate Comasco dove stasera ci sarà il suo concerto al teatro Aurora il 27 sarà al Big Mama a Roma il 28 a Reggio Emilia al Fuori Orario il 29 ad Aviano Velvet è venuto soltanto con la chitarra mentre la sua band fa il sound check da un'altra parte lui è qui per questo pezzo che si chiama Shelly's Blues Stay Way Darling, it's a shame The way they play you like a game Baby, it's a sin The way you never seem to win Shelly, can't you understand? I only want to be your friend Shelly, can I say it again? I really want to be your friend Honey, I want to know Why everything seems to scare you so Baby, what can I say? you do it your way Shelly can't you understand I only want to be your friend Shelly can I say it again I really want to be your friend ba -da -da -ba -ba. quello di oggi quindi è qui con noi Seawin che è venuto a presentarci il suo ultimo lavoro che si chiama Melting in the Dark eccolo guardiamolo qui eh, questa foto peraltro è bellissima faremo due chiacchiere dopo averlo sentito peraltro sicuramente tutti voi lo ricorderete come grandissimo leader dei grandissimi Dream Syndicate ma adesso Seawin a segnare di tutto we call home torn and divided but never alone shadows reveal what we try to conceal here in this palace of broken glass nothing is promised so nothing is asked nothing delivered when nothing is severed i love you i hate you caress and berate you no miracles no more only 
only the shadows badly lit from above what we call love here in this heaven for fools it's loser take all till we change all the rules silence becomes you and darkness betrays you i want you i crave you i kiss and enslave you no miracles no more only the shadows badly lit from above what we call love of this song. Thank you. There's but, some pretty dark lyrics there. Yeah, but that, that's what I like, actually. <laughs> okay, would you like to hold the microphone? Yes, is that, absolutely. Is, okay, oh, is no, that possible can, for you? That, yes. Okay. Ho detto sai Steve che adoro le, canzone, le, le parole di questa canzone, lui mi dice sì però c'è un lato molto scuro eh, in queste parole, dico beh mi piacciono proprio per questo, lui dice beh allora meglio così, allora vorrei dare, have a, let's have a second look to the cover of your record, vorrei dare una mh, seconda eh, occhiata a questa, mh, a questa copertina perché volevo fare una domanda appunto relativa a questa copertina, that's a very um, beautiful uh, picture, uh, where, where did you get it, dove l'hai fatta? That was taken um, outside of New York City where I live, a place mm -hmm. called Coney Island, which maybe yeah. Well, that's, that's super it's, it's famous. It's very famous, yes, yeah. and it's kind of an old area with a lot of carnivals uh -huh. and sideshows and freak shows and things yeah. like that. And you, you, you look at that part of it, yeah. and it's just very picturesque, roller coasters, all of this. But you walk a few more feet, and you've got this very, very deserted, creepy kind of beach, and that's where we shot that's that That's where I want to leave. I mean, you're just telling me so yeah. many beautiful things about this place. That's where I want to go and leave. Oh, yes. Allora, mi dice, è vicinissimo al posto dove vivo, perché io vivo a New York. Yes. Eh, questo posto è a Coney Island, che peraltro probabilmente molti di voi conoscerete. Bene, la prima parte è un po' classica, c'è cioè, molta gente, ma se poi cammini un po' di più, eh, ti avventuri in una zona veramente bellissima, un po' desertica, con queste mh, dune di sabbia, ed è proprio lì che abbiamo fatto... Eh, questa bellissima eh, foto. Ok, uh, silence is your only friend. This is, such, this is uh, pretty rare as a title for a musician, isn't it? Mm. Allora, silence uh, um, is your only friend, è l'unico tuo amico, che okay? è uno dei suoi titoli, dico però è abbastanza un titolo strano per un musicista. I think if you're a touring musician, silence is something you get very little of actually, so <laughs> it's a very good friend sometimes. Especially però, when you live in a place like New York City. <laughs> <laughs> però dice, beh, ti posso dire una cosa, che ogni volta, se magari ti capita di poter stare un po' in silenzio, eh, ti posso dire che il silenzio per, anche per un musicista può essere veramente un buon compagno, soprattutto quando vivi a New York City. Have you ever been, uh, have you ever living uh, in New York? Hai sempre vissuto a New York? Have I ever lived there? Yeah. Um, um, I live there now, I'm, I'm from Los Angeles, but I okay. moved to New York a year and a half ago. Uh -huh. um, and just, I like it there a lot. Allora, ho mai sempre vissuto a New York? Lui mi dice, no, io veramente prima vivevo a Los Angeles, eh, però adesso vivo a New York. Tell me a pro and a con if a friend of yours would like to move to New York, because that's the city where I want to live probably because I adore Lou Reed, and that's, I reckon, ah, okay, yes. that, 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 that's the city, but tell me a pro and a con for living in New York. Dimmi un pro e un contro per qualcuno per andare a vivere a New York. Well, I'm, I'm like you, Paul. I mean, I, I, I want to spend my, I want to live there my entire life, mm. and I finally did move there. Mm. I think they're almost all pros. All, uh, the, the pros are that the city 
honestly never sleeps. It, 24 hours a yeah. day, things go on and on and on. I guess the con is that the city never sleeps also and you never sleep either. <laughs> allora mi dice guarda Paola posso dirti che sono esattamente come te perché quella è la città dove volevo vivere eh, per buona parte della mia vita anche se ho appena, mi sono appena trasferito eh, a New York e sai cos'è la cosa più bella? Esattamente come dice la canzone una, è una città che non dorme mai allora nel momento in cui ti trasferisci a New York anche tu sei tranquillo che perdi il sonno perché ci sono tantissime cose da fare. Ok, so let me something, let's go back to the music. Do you have still a little, ok. Sì adesso parlo anche con Robocop in inglese ormai qui ci siamo internazionalizzati al massimo possibile. Telling him something in English. Okay, um, tell me something. How did you uh, meet the, the calm? I mean, the band from from Boston, I guess. Right, Is that right. Wrong? Yes, yes. And how did you decide to, to play together? Which was the first song that you played together? And they say, okay, let's go and keep on playing together. Well, I've actually been friends with the singer Talia Zedek from mm -hmm. Calm for about about, whew, about 12 years now. Um, and and when they formed this band, Calm, I was a very big fan of their mm -hmm. records. And um, They, we had a friend in common, we were passing messages back and forth for a long time, I want to play with those guys, they want to play with me, and finally we just said, you know, we, we, we talked for a long time, and said, let's just do it. I took a train up to Boston, we recorded eight songs in one day, and that was half the album. Greg, veramente eccezionale eh, ho detto come mh, ti sei messo insieme con questa band appunto Come di Boston dice eravamo amici con la cantante a 12 anni io sempre volevo suonare con ci facciamo la corte insomma per suonare insieme un giorno ho preso un treno sono andato a Boston mi ci sotto canzoni da lì è andato tutto when will be back in tour in Italy? Um, I hope very soon I like coming here as much as possible Good. so, so do you promise you will be back here in this show? oh I would love to come back ok allora detto, quando ritorni in tour mi ha detto presto ho detto prometterò di ritornare a questa di fumo ma ha detto sì ok un'altra canzone Stewie Smoke signals. On the day that they left, they placed a ring around his neck so they know where he came from. He was tired of all the lies and all the shallow ties, and he was tired of acting dumb. But on the third day alone, he was waiting by the phone for any familiar voice. And he recalled an older day when he wished everyone away, but now he didn't have the choice. And the angels won't talk to me anymore. The angels won't talk to me anymore. On the day that she left, she says it was for the best. She says a person's got to grow. She left all of her friends, she says everything ends And we'll stay in touch, you know But she couldn't believe, she couldn't hardly conceive That they would take her at her word Staring at the wall, wishing anyone would call Man, it all seems so absurd And the angels won't talk to me anymore The angels won't talk to me anymore She left and thought he never would regret what he said or what he'd done. He had struggled for years against frustration and tears, and now he didn't need anyone. But after throwing all the switches and pulling all the stitches, man, everything felt so flat. And he thought about me to show how badly he was grieving, but it was much too late for that. And the angels won't talk to me anymore. I've got the last question. No, I don't, I don't have any more time for questions, okay? But you promise you will be back, so Absolutely. we'll have time to chat. Absolutely. Okay, grazie tanta, see you in, take care, you. and see you soon. Grazie, un bacio. Publicitati.